everyone, I am Tamseel Asif and I am the anchor of National News Nama and I will do English programs here. And today we are here to ask the values of Christian in Pakistan. When I see so much persecution in Pakistan happening with Christians, my heart cries with the tear of blood. So much tears have shed and so much pain we have suffered here in Pakistan. Did we vote it for Pakistan to be called Chuda here? If we look back at the history of Pakistan, did we give education? Did we give hospitals to be called Chuda here? If we look back at 1970, as long as Christians were needed, you accepted us as, as chief of army staff. As chief justice, you accepted us as speakers of Punjab. Did we vote it for Pakistan? To see blood flowing in the form of Shantinagar, in the form of Tibba, Sangla Hill, Lahore, Kasur, Joseph Kaluni, Faisalabad, Yohanabad, Christian girls are molested and gang raped. Did we free Pakistan to be prosecuted here? You people are so much full of hatred for us that you burned our settlements. If I remember Gojira, in Gojira, you burned nine women with their children while burning their settlements. If I recall Shama and Shahzad in 2014, first you beated them, then you tortured them, and after facing a lot of prosecution, you burned them alive in the furnace. Just a few days ago, when Independence Day was celebrated in the churches, and prayers were offered, for the safety of Pakistan, you people are full of so much hatred for us that you destroyed the churches. A cross is a sign of salvation for the Christian believers and the nations. But you desecrated our cross in the churches by breaking them. From July two months ago, Bless Me case has started to be registered in Sargoda. Jarawala wrote history that more than 26 churches were burned in one day. Persecution of Christians also happened in India. But this incident has written history and the people of Jarawala are still being threatened. And the people want army to send there for their protection in Jarawala. On 24th August 2023, a panic was spread in Pindi, Dhoksida, due to some miscreants and people left their houses in fear. Unknown FIRs are registered in Sargoda and a woman who was working in a Muslim house from Kasur has been charged that she has desecrated the Holy Quran. And now she has left with her family in fear. The matter is not over yet. It's, it is still ongoing. For how long the Christians will face the prosecution in Pakistan? This time, we don't want your sympathy words. This time, the government should not build houses and churches for us. The government should not give us financial charity. This time, we want justice. Remember one thing, justice delayed is a justice denied. Remember us, in your precious prayers, God bless you.